How's it going YouTube? Happy Easter! I'm Landon and this is where I try to make the news a whole lot more interesting for you. But first and last video I asked you, what inspires you in life? And this is what you all said. What inspires me is Minion. He makes me want to wake up every single morning and make videos for all of you lovely people. Today's coming question of the day is, what is your favorite holiday? So how many of you guys are celebrating Easter today? Or did you celebrate it over the weekend with your friends and family? Well today was known to be the day where Jesus was resurrected. Lots of people go to church with their families to celebrate. The most popular thing to do is decorating Easter eggs. Well, all over the internet, I'm seeing this right here. What the heck is going on? What's with all these girls trying to show off their bodies on a very religious day? I mean, I'm seeing these pictures on news sites, Instagram, and all over Facebook, and now I have these pictures on my TV screens. I mean, come on, what's going on? It's not Halloween. Is this a time to celebrate Jesus or to strip down like pretty much naked? I mean, what would Jesus think? Even Sports Illustrate got involved and got their models to put on bunny ears and bunny tails and to pose. I don't know what I think about the whole thing. What do you guys think? Okay, moving on to the box office over the weekend. Furious 7 came out and it met all expectations and it made over $143 million at the box office. It became the highest grossing movie on the weekend ever for the month of April. The movie also landed itself at the ninth spot all time for a weekend opening. Furious 7 was highly watched because of Paul Walker and his death. It was the last time that we were able to see Paul Walker on the big screen. I highly recommend the movie. It was amazing. And Paul Walker's stunt double, which was his brother, played an awesome job as him. You couldn't even tell the difference near the end of the movie. Also, the franchise paid tribute to Paul. It was a whole bunch of remarkable scenes he was in. It for sure gave a tear in my eye because Fast and the Furious, they're all like family in the movie and also friends and family outside the movie as well. Second at the box office was Home. The 20th Century Fox movie brought in $27 million and Get Hart starring Kevin Hart and Will Ferrell made just under $13 million. Alright, here's another Easter story for you guys. This right here is the world's biggest bunny. I mean is this real life right now? How big are they? Well, they measure a whopping 4 feet 4 inches tall. I mean god damn. And they're 7 years old. Imagine giving your kids one of these. It's like here. It just killed them. I would be afraid of the bunny eating it, although bunnies don't eat humans. But you can just get your kids, just like pick them up, because yeah, this is how I pick up my kids, and just put them on the bunny, and the bunny can just like hop you around the yard or something. So to feed these guys, it costs 5,000 British pounds, and they go through 2,000 carrots and 700 apples every year. And guess what? These two bunnies, they have an offspring. And right now, he's 3 feet 8 inches tall. And the big guy still has another 6 months of growing. So watch out, mother and father. Your record is going to be broken. Okay, do you guys want to hear about something super cool? Amazon is trying to revolutionize the world once again with their futuristic technology. They came out with this thing that is an ordering button. Let me explain what I'm talking about. Here's a Tide button stuck to a washing machine. Well, once your clothes are running out of soap, all you have to do is push the button and Amazon places the order for you to get more soap. I mean, isn't this cool? You don't have to do anything. You can be the ultimate lazy person. And they also have things for coffee, bounty, and other common household products. Something else that's pretty awesome is by 2039, NASA believes that they can land the first astronauts on the red planet, Mars. They will start orbiting it around 2033 to learn more of its properties. NASA says they're confident they have the budget to do this. So the mission will last about 30 months. Okay, lastly, some serious news. There was a massacre shooting by terrorists. They killed hundreds of people at a Kenyan university. 148 people were pronounced dead at the scene. So initially, one person and survive. In later reports, they were saying that there might be other survivors as well. So the one person I'm talking about survived because they hid in a wardrobe for two days. The person was identified as 19 year old Cynthia. Hundreds of people gathered around to pay tribute to everyone who lost their lives. There were a lot of graphics online that I was looking at and I was like, oh my god, I can't show you guys these images because they're just way too graphic. But there were pretty much of all these students just dead in the classrooms and there was blood everywhere. Police confirmed that there was four terrorists who were involved with this massacre shooting. They had loaded guns and also they strapped explosives to themselves in case the police got too close. All they have to do is blow themselves up. So right now they're still out there. They haven't been caught. There is a bounty on their head for over 145,000 British pounds. My sincere condolences goes out to the loved ones, the family and friends of all the people that lost their lives. It was just a brutal scene and really brutal to report on. Well anyways you guys, thank you so much for watching. That's all the news stories I found in the news today. I hope you you enjoyed. A little sad near the ending, but I'll see you all in the next video. 
So imagine that, you're turning on the TV and you're hearing about another freaking massacre that happened in school. I mean, come on, why are you taking other people's lives? But these are the types of stories that I like to report on. I like to make them a little bit lighter. Let me know if you guys like them. If you guys want more videos, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want a video right now, look over to your left. There's two videos waiting for you to click on. Okay, bye.